obviously trip to the new zoo. Neil Anderson joins us live this morning from Swamico. Good morning, Neil. Hi, Neil. Hey, good morning. Well, beautiful morning out here. And, you know, we've been talking about new arrivals, you know, over the last couple of weeks. And I think we got an update. We got a picture of the little red wolf pups, oh. how well they're doing. They're about three weeks old right now. How many of them and, are there? Uh, there are six of them. And uh, like I said, they're about three weeks old and their eyes are just starting to open this week, which is kind of interesting. The you know, keepers went in, you know, and our veterinarian, Dr. Gilbert, checked them out. They're all real healthy. Everything's going well. But you know, when their eyes open, they kind of open from the inside out. And uh, it won't be long, probably a week or two. If, normally it's after four weeks that they'll start venturing outside the den. So in about two weeks, uh, when you come out to the zoo, you'll get a chance to see them because they should be out there with mom and dad out there on the exhibit. So you want to make sure you come and check them out. You know, and the other thing is uh, we've got a wonderful opportunity to witness something here too. And this is uh, our trumpeter swans. And yesterday, you know, after 34 days of incubation, the eggs started to hatch. Oh. Now, I think we've got between eight or nine eggs. Really? And they're hatching right now. This is going to take about a 24-hour period for them all to hatch, somewhere in there. So if you come out to the zoo, you'll get an opportunity to see that because right now she's in that process. So you can see how she's got her wings flattened out. Yeah. And what that's telling me right now is what she's doing is, is the wings are flattened out more. That means there's more and more of the little cygnets hatching out. Now I saw one pop his head out, you know, <laughs> right underneath the wing earlier today. We're not sure how many had hatched out so far, but uh, we're seeing movement underneath the wings. So this is real significant because this pair has been here for the, you know, at the zoo for about 10 years. Oh, there's and, one. Uh, oh, yeah, yep. Yeah, you can see one little one down there, kind of like a little, little whitish gray color. Yeah. And they're only seven ounces, you know. The eggs themselves, they're four inches long, about three and a half inches wide. Pretty good size egg. You know, normally eight to nine is what uh, she's been laying. And last year we had nine cygnets. And, you know, what's really great with this program is... Uh, they get to go back to the uh, to the wild too. So nine of the cygnets now are back in the state of Iowa, and will be back out in the wild. But uh, yeah, we'll we'll show you a little bit more about that in this whole process oh, uh, coming up in the next couple segments. I remember when you first got them. Thanks, Neil. Yeah, sounds good. Next hour of Good Day Wisconsin.